But of course, the big story this afternoon, I'm sure many of you have noticed the videos from over the weekend, the crowds gathering um, outdoors. And like, I'm not going to go down the Tut Tut Road or the finger wagging because this was completely avoidable, absolutely avoidable over the weekend. And it's going to be the exact same thing replicated next weekend if we don't plan for this. It's very simple. Crowd control is the solution. It has to be controlled. Like personally, I think the outdoor dining and drinking should be opened that little bit earlier. It's very controlled. You have six people at the table. But in the absence of that, you need to bring in some sort of a control measure. If you're going to pedestrianise streets or and pedestrianise areas across, whether it be Dublin, Cork or Galway, you absolutely have to spend the next day or two working out what the max capacity figure is going to be. So that next Friday and Saturday and Sunday, we know that we're allowed X number of people around South William Street and Drury Street. We're allowed Y number of people down in the Spanish Arch in Galway. You have to plan for that. Like we're after spending the last four or five months telling everybody that the outdoor dining and the outdoor drinking and spending your summers outdoors, that that's going to be the way to be. You can't bitch and moan then when that's exactly what people do. And yes, it's going to mean you're going to need more security your guards around the area and I know nobody's going to want to sanction overtime for that but you cannot ask people to plan a summer outdoors and then give out when that is what they do it's it, like it's crowd control is the solution here and talking today in some of the papers about indoor dining potentially being affected about this no Absolutely not. There is like what happened at the weekend was avoidable. You need to plan for this weekend and you've got five days now to do it.